What's up, Mahanasin? So in our last video, we talked about how you used the little USB-C key to do the Google multi-factor authentication. But this video is going to show you how to download the Google Authenticator app so that you can use your phone as your authentication key instead of needing to carry around that little USB-C. So first thing you do, you go into your account, you go to google.com, click on your name in the top right, and then you're going to go here to security on the left hand side, scroll down and you will see the two factor authentication. You click the two step verification, it's going to ask you to put your password in again. And once you've done that, you are going to scroll down to where it says Google Authentication App. You're going to click on the Google Authentication App. It's then going to prompt if you're using an Android phone or a iPhone and it's going to then tell you after you've chosen which phone you have to go to the either the Android or the Google Play Store or the Apple Store and download the app called Google Authenticator app. This is what the Google Authenticator app looks like. You download it. After the Authenticator app is loaded, you are then going to get started by swiping through this and hitting scan a QR code. You're then going to take your phone and scan the QR code that is shown right on your screen right here. So you take your phone, you scan it, and after you scan it on the app itself, it will then tell you a six-digit code on your phone. You take that six-digit code from your phone and you type it into this box on the computer. And once you finish that, you click verify. And now, anytime that you sign in for the first time in the day, and it asks for that verification, you don't need that physical USB-C key. You just open up the app on your phone, say, yes, this is me, click it, and you'll be good to go. Hopefully this video helps. If you have any questions, you know where to reach me. Work hard, play hard, and I'll catch you next time.